All right, y'all. What's up? Wifey here. So it is roughly nine o'clock in the morning, and I'm officially completely unpacked with everything at Eastern. However, it occurred to me I have no socks. So we're going to do a sock haul from Amazon and make it a whole video thing. So, yeah. So I recently posted on my Snapchat story, send me links to socks on Amazon that you would like for me to review. And so, yeah, let's get started. I've got Amazon pulled up right here, and we are just going to search. You know what? First off, since y'all know me from the one TikTok, let's start off with something super basic. So we're going to search for strawberry socks. And I cannot spell. Ooh, so I actually already have these puppy socks. I have the Shiba one, I have the Frenchie one, and I have whatever dog this one is. So, yeah, that's actually really cool. I didn't realize they came in more. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to add the rest of those puppy socks to the cart because I love dogs. Okay, so the puppy socks are added to the cart. Let's keep strolling. Ooh, they have kitties. And they are so cute. But I also really like these just because it shows the cat belly, but I also feel like it's really awkward. Like, I don't like the fact that they had to include, like, that nub thing, you know? It, mm, not my thing. However, yeah, let's go with these. We're gonna go with these. All right, so we've got two of them added to cart. We're gonna go back to our search for strawberry socks. Because you can never have too many things that are strawberry, apparently. That, and I feel like it'll match like 99% of my clothes at this point. Okay, so I actually already have a pair like these coming in. And I would want a multi-pack. I wouldn't just want like one strawberry sock. These are precious. Look at these. They've got watermelon, peach, strawberry, banana, and avocado. So we're gonna go with these. These are cute. Also, I don't know if you noticed, but I'm actually on smile.amazon.com instead of www.amazon.com. This is purely because if you do go on Smile, that will donate a portion of the proceeds to a charity. I think I believe I have mine currently sent to Big Cat Rescue, but I currently cycle through charities such as Coping for Kids, Coping for Life, Big Cat Rescue, multiple different options. Um, I do the American Lung Association quite often. So, yes. And then I also, I don't know if you notice, but if you will notice a little H icon popping up in this area, that is actually Honey, and that is a coupon app that I really, really just adore. So we're going to keep searching cute women's socks. See, I have the cat socks in the cart. I have puppy socks in the cart. Are those painting socks? And those are cactus socks. Okay. Honestly, I would like the painting socks a lot more if they were more pastel, but these just feel a little bit gaudy for my taste. I don't typically wear, if you can tell by my room, I don't typically do a whole lot of bright colors. I used to be goth. I was goth for a very long time and only wore black, but now I've kind of switched to pastel with my weight loss. So, but there are some really cute options here. Ooh, I love these. I would love them more if they didn't have that grip stuff on the bottom, though, because I feel like 99% of the appeal of socks is just being able to slide everywhere in them and the grip kind of kills it. Ooh, those are Kadima. You know what I want to know if they have? I'm curious as to whether or not they have any pushing socks, because I absolutely am a sucker for pushing. Pushing women's socks. Let's go. They do. Oh, this makes me happy. I love it. They have ice cream pushing socks. 
So, heck yeah, we're going to do this. We're going to see. I'm curious as to whether or not these are women's socks, though. Oh, Department of Women's, okay. Is there anything? Customer reviews. Looks like they're pretty solid. Very cute socks. Ooh. Okay, so it seems like they fit pretty nice. So that's good. They seem like they fit pretty solid. Um, it still doesn't have, where are the nine answer questions? Okay. So the issue with this is I do wear a size 10 in shoes, so I will be filming the socks later in person and seeing if they fit, but we're going to go to my cart and if you hear squeaking in the background, that's because my little, little boy is about to wake up, so give me a sec. All right, y'all, as you can see, my little Pegasus has joined the party. Uh, he does have bedding in his fur. He's a very, very long-haired hamster. He does get trims regularly to get the bedding out, but he doesn't like the alfalfa texture bedding that's meant for long hair hamsters. He absolutely hates it, will not use it, will throw a fit, will stop eating. And so keeping him with a little bit of long, longer, softer bedding is the only way I can keep this little dude happy. I promise I'm a good hamster owner. But as you can see here, I've got the pushing ankle socks, fruit socks, cat socks, and the rest of those puppy socks. So I will film the rest of this video once the socks come in. Oh, cancel. All right, y'all, I did not sleep at all last night, if you can tell by the bags under my eyes. Yes, they're designer. Uh, but the socks came in today, so I'm going to review them. Sorry if I sound crabby, I just got done working. I haven't slept for 42 hours now. Things have been a little crazy. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and review the socks. So the very first socks that I found were puppies. So I'm going to go ahead and open these up. I actually, as I mentioned, had some of these already. So I actually already had these ones and these ones. So now I actually added to my collection and so now I also have these three which is precious. This little husky has the brightest blue eyes and I love it. So uh, I'm gonna go ahead and put these on. Uh, they don't really tell you what breed they are which is kind of disappointing because I really I want to know is this a Doberman Pinscher, or is this supposed to be a German Shepherd? Uh, if you guys have any other guesses for a dog this might be, please let me know. But I'm 99% sure this is supposed to be a Frenchie. This is supposed to be a Husky. This is supposed to be a Shiba. And then I think this is another Frenchie, or this could be a Pity, which I'm not 100% sure. That's just my guess. Uh, I grew up around dogs. I've had them my entire life. So, uh... Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and try these on. Uh, I think I'm going to go with the Husky, just because I love the eyes. So, again, I am a size 10 in women's shoes. Uh, skizzers. Skizzers are a thing that I probably should have grabbed, but I didn't think. So, I will be right back. Still hunting for scissors. This is great. I am not prepared for this video at all, if you can tell. Uh, didn't actually think they'd be coming in today. Uh, I was told there's actually going to be a shipping delay. So, yeah. 
Huh. It's been a day. It's been definitely a long day. There are my keys. Okay. So I think I'll be able to use my key to open it, hypothetically. So. Yeet. I got him open without tearing the socks. Score. So, got him open. Almost, apparently. Little tab thing. So, I'm just gonna go ahead and try one on. Right off the bat, they're super nice quality. These ones are actually, I think, thicker than my, my usual puppy socks, but they look like, I'll angle the camera down so you can see, they look like this. They're very cute and little ears stick up, which is perfect. And so yeah, that is pair one of the sock haul, definitely would call that a success. So moving on to the next pair of socks I looked at lovely view of my tattoo there. Uh, we're gonna get rid of the puppy socks, put them in the drawer with the rest of my socks. All three of them because I forgot to bring them with me to school. The next ones I looked at were uh, the kitty socks that I wanted to match my puppies. So they actually look like this. When I first saw these I actually thought these were like toiletries. But then I realized they have paw prints on them so I think these are the kitty socks. And then you watch me order them so you guys know exactly what I searched. Right off the bat, these feel significantly thinner than the puppy socks, but they also feel significantly softer. Oh, and there's two cat faces. There's one on the inside of the leg and one on the outside. That makes my life easy. So these are the kitty socks. The ear is here and here, and it's the same ear for both sides, cat face here here. And then there are just little paw prints all over them. These are actually really, really comfortable. I actually really like these. Uh, I think these are so far my favorite. So, yes, kitty socks, also a success. Uh, I'm really surprised. I actually thought for Amazon socks, they actually wouldn't be that good of quality. But these have been pretty solid so far. So, we're going to put these in my sock drawer now, so I actually have a solid collection of socks. So then the next one that I looked at was the thing that I searched for first, which was the strawberry socks. And I actually... Uh, I'm going through these, and there is also banana, avocado, I think this is supposed to be a strawberry. Yeah, this is the strawberry. And then watermelon and these little peachy boys. So I'm gonna go ahead and try on the strawberry ones because strawberry princess over here. So. It feels like these are rougher. Like these are almost that canvasy material that I was kind of expecting, but they also feel super thick, so these actually might be really, really nice for in winter. So I'm going to go ahead and put these on. Ooh, they stretch. They stretch a lot. So these are actually really nice. If you look at these, they stretch quite a bit. They fit really well. They flow into motion. They're not too tight. They're not leaving elastic marks here, which is really nice. So also a success. Then there's the pair that I was questionable on. If you guys remember earlier in the video, I was actually not sure if these pushing socks would fit. Uh, everyone was saying they ordered them for like their small, smaller relative. So these look tiny, but they are supposed to be ankle socks. Cool. Maybe they're supposed to be tiny, but these have pushing all over them, and 
It's got like the pushing logo on the tag. It's got uh, the copyright. It's got all the information on it there. It also has information on how to wash them, which would be super helpful if I didn't live at a uni. So I'm going to go ahead and put on these ones, but these are pushing and ice cream socks. And I want to put on the ones with the pink pushing and the purple ice cream because I'm basic. These are so small. Like, that's two. These are so small. I don't think these are going to fit at all. But we will see. Holy cow! What? Okay, so this itty bitty sock stretches to be this big one. And it's a true ankle sock. Like, it's not like those no show ones that, like, have nothing here. Like, it's true. True ankle socks. So these are amazing. I don't know how they've managed to make such a small sock just stretch so much, but these are super comfy. I actually really love these. So yeah, uh, that was me buying socks for my dorm room because we got here and then my mom pointed out I had none. So if you like the video, please like, subscribe. Uh, this is a wifey video from Just Went Viral, and keep an eye out because my sponsored video should be coming out sometime soon. We'll see. So, uh, my sponsored video, um, I will announce who the company is, I will announce everything. It is Just Went Viral's first official sponsored video. So, yeah! Uh, thanks for watching, you guys. I know I look like an actual train wreck right now. Apologies. But uh, socks from Amazon, definitely a win. Wouldn't have thought about it, but they really, they were, they flex. So, would recommend. Uh, and then I'm not going to post the links actually down below, just because I actually screen captured everything so you can see what I searched, you can see exactly what the seller is and what I clicked on. So, there should be no surprises there. Um, but yeah, and if I had to pick a favorite, uh... I think I'm gonna go with kitties. I think I really love those kitten socks. I think those are precious. They came in such cute colors and they were cheap and they got delivered, which meant I didn't have to go out and go shopping. So that's like a triple win. So yeah, that is all I have for this video. I'm gonna go and pass out now uh, and I will talk to you guys later. Bye. All right, viral fans, make sure you like this video and hit that thumbs up button and subscribe. You can follow me on Insta at Lyric and Genius, and you can find me on TikTok at Wifey Homegirl. Thanks, y'all!